All right, fellas, I stopped at Ace Hardware where my mother-in-law works and I get a discount or get her family discount on steel or anything that I buy there actually. So we went with Hey, good morning guys, Joey First String Lawn Care here. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, uh, guys, I'd appreciate it if you think about subscribing. Uh, go ahead, while you're watching the video right now, hit that thumbs up button. Uh, guys, today on the schedule, we've got, well, I worked yesterday, I worked all through the weekend again. Uh, didn't get everybody caught up. I had five properties left that I couldn't get to yesterday uh, from Friday schedule. And these properties are all weekly and they grow pretty quick and it's everything right now this Bermuda uh, with the rain we've be, been getting and these hot temperatures it's man it's it's growing like crazy right now so I can't wait to next Friday to mow these so I'm gonna have to uh, I'm gonna have to go ahead and try to hit these five today on our schedule which is gonna put us at 13 properties today one of those properties I'm gonna have to put out some mulch <laughs> At least I think I am. I may change my mind. It depends on how, how much work we're getting done and how fast we're getting done. And another one of the properties, uh, he wants his hedges trimmed. So, and two of those, and two other of those properties are new properties. And you know how that goes when you have a new property. Uh, the One of those properties, though, the customer, I told them yesterday we weren't going to make it. And he said, you know, no problem if you want to wait till this Friday. Uh, you can so I may take him up on that and only do 12 properties today because uh, I did look I when I went out to take a look at his property it was uh, it wasn't it's honestly it could probably be bi-weekly just from the looks of it it didn't look like he had any weed control fertilization or anything it's actually kind of brown um, so I may take him up on that I think we can hold off on that one but uh the biggest thing is, I'm getting ready. It's it's 8.30, gotta meet Glenn at nine, or nine-ish. Um, I'm gonna run and get some new uh, blowers, not backpack blowers, uh, some handheld blowers, and I'm gonna get us two new weed eaters. Um, I have the KM131 combi kit uh, steel um, with all the attachments, uh, that, that one runs good, it's just heavy, man, uh, out here right now, as hot as it is, and, you know, being in the grind, I mean, it's just tough running that weed eater all day, you know, you really gotta get used to it, um, and I just wanna save some energy, and we've got the FS94R, and it's light as a feather, but, man, it only runs good during the morning, and then you have to, it's like in the morning time that weed eater will crank up first pull you know the first couple yards it does good but if you run it for just a little bit turn it off and then go back go to the next yard i can't get it to start uh you have to crank and crank and crank and crank on that thing man and you know how it is when you're out here you know it's hard enough it's hard enough just being out here but when you sit and crank on a weed eater about 10 pulls before it starts you just want to sling it you know so I'm going to go get us two new weed eaters. And I'm thinking about getting the, uh, uh, the 91, I think. The FS91. I think, I think I'm going to, I'm going to look at that one and see what the rating is on that as far as the commercial use. I think that's what it is. Um, so I'm probably going to get two of those. And I'm also, I don't know, uh, I don't know if I want to get just the re the, the regular gas powered uh, just handheld blowers because I tell you what man dragging these that uh, these backpack blowers down off the racks uh, and putting them back up knowing that there's something small or like th those are, those backpack blowers are great they work great they run great but you don't need that to blow off a driveway 
you know, to blow a few clippings around in the yard. It's just, it's a waste of, total waste of energy. So I'm gonna get us either two handheld gas and, or I'm gonna get us uh, two of the handheld battery powered steel. I don't know which ones I'm gonna get yet. That'll be a surprise and I'll show you on the video uh, later today. But uh, guys, that's what we got going on today. Stay tuned, I'll get you some footage. It's Joey from First String Lawn Care. Let's go get it. All right, fellas. The footage of today is gonna be Glenn mowing. <clears throat> Thank you.
All right, fellas, I stopped at Ace Hardware where my mother-in-law works and I get a discount or get her family discount on steel or anything that I buy there actually. So we went with, we got us two brand new FS-111Rs and I've picked up these two little handheld uh, leaf blowers. These are the uh, the BG-86s. Now, we won't have to get these backbreakers off just to blow off driveways and stuff like that. But uh, that's what I went with, guys. Let's get going here.